Once again, the Eater of Worlds, Bray Wyatt, calls out the dead man, the Undertaker, the man who was undefeated at WrestleMania for 21 years, 21 and 1, and his 22nd year at WrestleMania, he lost to Brock Lesnar, the man, the Eater of Worlds, the cryptic one. He is calling out the dead man, the Undertaker, the Phenom. Uh, so far tonight, uh, the Undertaker has not replied uh, to Bray Wyatt. Uh, I'm surprised with uh, just a little over uh, an hour to go that the Undertaker did not respond yet. Uh, so far, it's looking like uh, that Bray, the Undertaker is not going to be, uh, you know, be uh, making his return this week or unless he comes and file like Bray Wyatt keeps telling the Undertaker come find me or I'm gonna come find you so if the Undertaker does not come find Bray Wyatt soon we will see the Eater of Worlds go and be a stalker and stalk the Undertaker and find him and beat him into giving him a match at the uh, at WrestleMania 31 for the 23rd year of the Undertaker uh, fighting at WrestleMania. 23 years of fighting at WrestleMania. How insane is that? Uh, more on that another time. But, you know, uh, Bray Wyatt was somewhere in a dark place with a casket that he is specially made for The Undertaker. And he wants The Undertaker very badly at WrestleMania 31. And it is going to be very interesting to see if The Undertaker, you know, if he uh, phenoms up or if he cowers down. There's been a lot of news and rumors and stuff around the internet saying The Undertaker's weak and fragile and all this other crap. But that's a bunch of baloney. The Undertaker is the phenom. He's the dead man. And he will he will answer the call to the bra to Bray Wyatt and he will face him in a casket match at WrestleMania 31. I'm hoping a casket match, maybe it'll just be a normal match, but I believe the Phenom, the Undertaker, will rise once again and he will come to WrestleMania 31 to take on Bray Wyatt. And there you have it. Like the video, subscribe, leave a comment, and share the video.